And then they come back and then they go off in another direction and then they come back and you really want to say to them it's that way but you're not allowed to okay at the higher levels the orienteering gets harder and harder for example you may have two tracks either side of a hedgerow now if you walk along the outside and see if you can get him to walk through the poles that's it. But in a competition, Joe would go through in front of him and he would follow behind her. And he says, I can't possibly do that. Oh, what a good boy. <laughs> it's amazing how many older horses will go over poles as trot poles, but when you ask them to go through the middle, it completely baffles them. It moved. Okay. It moved. Walk him past it, Joe. Just take him past it down the outside. That's it. Good. And then turn him round and then walk him back towards us through the pole so that he's walking towards the other horses. And just see if he'll come through, coming down towards everybody else. <laughs> I'm not going to do it. <coughs> I think the chickens have taken right, his eye. Sky, it'll be your turn next. <laughs> <laughs> okay. If he won't do that, walk him across it. Okay, just see what he does there. Stay at the side of him so that if he does decide to leap, you're not going to get leapt on. Or just walk him across one of the poles at, at the end. Something. He's so yeah. distracted by something over there. Chickens. <laughs> Chickens. He ain't taking no notice of the flag. No. <laughs> yeah, he's not bothered by the flag at all. The chickens, which he sees every day. But as we all know, that's horses. You never know what's going to set them off, what's going to make them look. Okay. That's it. Well done. Good boy. That's it. Give him a pat. Okay. The thing is today, we don't want to stress him out, you know, even if he just stands in here and watches what the others are doing and Stephanie, do you want to walk or trot? I'll leave it up to you. Yeah, I think she might have decided it's not a bit exciting. Okay. Um, don't 
Yes, good boy. Good boy. Good lad. You want to try walking through that one again now? Just walk over and just walk straight. Don't stop. Just keep going. Choose at each obstacle because each obstacle is marked individually. He says, "No, I don't like that one." <laughs> Even though they're green and white. <laughs> It. Horses really do do a lot of their exploring with their noses. Stand right in front of him, Joe. If you stand in front of him but don't look at him, okay, look up the arena. That's mm -hmm. it. Give him a big pat. <laughs> now he's seen the flag. <laughs> Bless him. But this is why, particularly with a horse where you don't know what its reactions are going to be like, getting in front of it is dangerous. So, you know, you want to stay at the side of them. Some of the obstacles in Trek which are done in hand, such as ditches, you wouldn't be expected to go in front of the horse because unless you really trust the horse, you don't want to get jumped on, you know. Um, that's it. That blooming chicken again, Frank. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. <laughs> okay. So you go the same way, that's it. And then see if he'll follow. Look at him watching. I said I can do the going back bit all right. Do the going backwards bit. That's it. There, good boy. That's fine. Tell him he's good. That's it. Good boy. And then see if you can get him to walk on a little bit more. Try not to look down at the poles yourself as well, Joe. Try to focus straight ahead all the time and almost ignore what's on the floor in front of you. Because where we look has a massive effect on what the horse does. That's it. He's like, is everyone watching me? He says, I'm very beautiful. I know I'm very beautiful. And I'm going to have lots of people watching me when I do my dressage. Good boy. Oh. Give him a big clap. Good pack. boy. And what's yeah. nice there is both times he, he's made up his mind very positively he's going to do it, but he hasn't rushed sometimes happens with horses is they make up their mind to do something they get halfway through and then they think shit why have I decided to do this and then they run out the other side and they panic a little bit what a good boy okay right